You know, in yeah. this stage, your mm. dilemma, mm. there's a lot of what he said. Yes. What will the community say? Mm. Though, you see, ah. as Sarano said, remember you still have the dream. Mm. <laughs> and dream yes. is what made you go to drama. Yes. Drama has yes. taken you now to dilemma. dilemma. Uh -huh. So in this stage, you are still wondering, mm. what will people say? Mm. And then we had a big wedding. Mm. The way it looked like this marriage will work. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of peace faking. Mm -hmm. oh. There's a lot of peace faking. Right. Most people they tend to think mm -hmm. that when I get married to him or her, yes, I will change him a few things. <laughs> I will change her. Mm -hmm. That's what the girls mm. and the young people tend to think. <laughs> you don't. You know that one is a a myth. <laughs> it doesn't. Work. How can you? Change it doesn't someone? work because you you cannot you get know? into their minds yes. and you cannot get it into their hearts yes. and change them yes. with your perspective. Yes, one has to to develop that kind of a positive attitude mm. and energy to mm. bring it to their marriage. So if it was not there, then he needs to, to, have, to have an introduction of new knowledge that will introduce a new kind of energy that is consistent with the marriage. Mm. So there is no change. And you see, probably, mm -hmm. uh, assume that maybe mm. uh, you, you, you got your husband yes. in a pub. Uh -huh. Okay? Oh yes. Akikunywa pombe. Akikunywa pombe. You know? Mm. Eh, na unasema ni mdimu bobo ana mzuri. Eh. Lakini ulimpata wapi? Kwa ba akikunywa pombe na akakwambia <laughs> niki when we marry yeah, I promise I will never this is the last one. This is the last one. Only to get into marriage and he begins to drink he comes when he's uh, he has fallen his head is swollen he has urinated on himself he has pooped on himself you have to carry him it's so frustrating. Regrets. Mm. So you're in a dilemma. Dilemma. Do you leave him? Do you go? Do you stay? Because your children already... are here. Yes. Uh -huh. You had seen a red flag, but yes. you did not it. Exactly. Mm. Let me just mm. say. I may just add something mm. because you're saying of a person who, I think these people who sometimes uh, are inconsistent in character mm -hmm. and their behaviors uh, at times do not align with the principles of marriage. Mm -hmm. Most of them are not self-aware. Yeah. They mm -hmm. don't even know they are of the problem. Mm -hmm. They don't even understand why they are there. Mm -hmm. And I always say that uh, the best gift you can do to your marriage or to your partner, partner mm -hmm. is to be self-aware. Mm -hmm. You have to know yourself. You have to know your weaknesses. You have to start cultivating that time with yourself to an extent that you begin discovering mm -hmm. my patterns, these are the patterns, this is, the, this is coming because of my childhood traumas. If you have a childhood trauma, you will realize. Because you find that even if we go to therapy, mm -hmm. the therapist will be just be asking you questions and still the solution will come from you. Mm -hmm. So all these things start from you and when you start to know yourself, you can even give your partner easy time to to navigate through or you can help them through but if both of us are not self-aware mm. we don't have time to get to develop ourselves mm. yeah you don't have time to know who you, who are you apart from your career apart from being a wife apart from being a minister mm. who are you yeah. what are the integral values that you weigh that you value most the integral things that aligns with your behaviors that you value most what are these things you need to sit to a point and say i think i keep behaving in this way and this keep repeating itself even you can find that most of the financial issues or many other mm. things people deal with in marriage mm. stem back from just something very small that happened and keep creating that patterns very that's true. why they are, they, are, they, are, they are teaching there is a, 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 a teaching of rewiring your brain subconsciously mm. that even the kid kama kuna mtoto aliwahi go through trauma kama abuse mm. they can rewire their brain by affirming something affirming something and mm. putting positive environment until they become a whole being mm. from within so people need to be self aware mm. because people who are not self aware even if they find good partners there is this person, they want something but they keep mm. re repelling it. If mm. that person come into their space, mm. that person will go because mm. they are not conducive to have those people. Mm. Yeah, so the self-awareness will help us in these stages. Yeah. You realize, wait a minute, we are on the drama stage. Oh, I'm still on the dream. 
you see yeah. yeah and i also think what mm. what kills most marriages during this drama stage mm. is it, it's dilemma. shutting down communication yeah. mm. uh, channels in the marriage mm. and i think last time we talked about being compatible in marriage mm -hmm. so that in case you find that both of you are people who don't open up and talk mm -hmm. then that marriage will not go anywhere it's i can say for example the two of us mm -hmm. we are also very opposite mm -hmm. when it comes to approaching an issue mm -hmm. i've had people who go through marriage whereby they have what you call nail by my mouth for even one week they don't talk to another mm -hmm. three months they don't talk to each other mm -hmm. if i found a lady was like me we would be like that because me, I'm someone who will just want to prolong an issue. We'll not talk about it now. Mm. Let us talk even about next week. I have no issue with that. Mm. But for her, she's someone who, when we have an issue, we have to discuss it right now and clear it today. Not because tomorrow. The, no, the and Bible not tomorrow. says do not go to bed with... Uh, I'm not even that. Bible, even the Bible, you, 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 you didn't even know Christ, so... <laughs> she didn't know I'm Christ. A I'm a uh, so, she, it is her personality <laughs> that she's always wishing to speak and speak and speak. Yeah. So when an issue came... I see peace, mm, I love peace. But she would hey, just press peace. it until I speak it out, mm. and I speak it out. Mm. And if... Another thing that I, I, I fear mm. is tense the environment, whereby mm. you are with the person and you can't talk. Yeah, mm. so me of that person, when, when there's an issue, mm. I just want to call and remain alone even if it's for one week i just remain without even talking to anybody My goodness just like that it is so psychological torture yes to yeah. 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 and for her mm. if she stays for 30 minutes without speaking mm. it traumatizes her mm. so she wants to i can stay if i'm happy but yeah if you are not she can happy. stay peaceful when she's happy I won't come on gay. but if there's an issue disturbing she'll be coming passing through you feeling like she's speaking something going back are you ready to speak nambia no she go back. We have to speak. Now let's speak about what I told you. There's nothing we are speaking about. Again, she'll come back. So we found that I was that person who, bring you who would have made the marriage fail mm -hmm. if I were uh, remain in that stage. So I will say, I also say that the best thing that we can do when we're in that dilemma stage is to always talk. speak, talk, and talk and talk. Mm -hmm. You can easily find a way and out. Actually, mm -hmm. I I totally agree with you mm -hmm. because one of the greatest pain of this third stage which is mm. dilemma mm. it is whereby you are in it but you can't talk to anybody about because it because you are in isolation and not only that mm. per adventure that you didn't begin well mm -hmm. when you are oh. beginning it you get it eh? so you're even fearing to go back to the parents so you can't go to the parents because they had even warned you about it uh -huh. ah now i'm seeing hey, you the regrets it, eh? are too much yeah? you don't go to church so you don't have a pastor oh yes <laughs> you you know, know, na kwa na kimeumana, yeah. neighbors they say they know you they, and they, they know you are a very oh, cool couple couple oh god <laughs> <laughs> now you are alone. You are alone. You get it, eh? Mm -hmm. And I think, eh, Pastor Sue, mm -hmm. that is even whereby yes. some people, because of now the torture, the mm -hmm. pain, um, the, the, the loneliness, mm -hmm. they contemplate even going to the witch doctors. Thank you. <laughs> now, because you are alone, ah, you are in isolation. So yes, the enemy is speaking yes, to you. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yes. Kalia umze. Uh -huh. yeah. Tafuta kalimanzea. <laughs> you know, you, you are there going Mombasa. Yes. Dio huyo yes. Tanzania. Mm -hmm. You know, looking mm -hmm. for someone, mm -hmm. a power that can come and subdue mm -hmm. your man mm -hmm. so that you can also feel you are in control. Mm -hmm. Because you are feeling so oppressed mm -hmm. by what is going on mm -hmm. in your marriage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's when people go to diviners. Uh -huh. Mamama wa maombi. Exactly. Oh, because now you are so isolated, you are in mm -hmm. Regrets. Mm. All right, all right. That's what. Mom, mm. let me add something. Yes. yes. People will go to diviners or to wrong friends or clubbing if you are alone. You 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 are lonely. Mm. Being alone doesn't mean you are lonely. But if you ha you are a person who is whole from within, mm -hmm. you have a relationship with God. There are times. When we were starting, my husband would attest. Mm. We would not talk. We would not agree. I just go and say, God. This is where we are. Mm. Pick us up and do whatever you can. <laughs> Very crazy prayer. <laughs> Just do what you can. I don't understand him. He doesn't understand me. I'm frustrated, God. I'm frustrated. I can't pray. Pick us up. <laughs> or, or, or she will come. Now that I cannot have this talk, so she'll come listen. and kneel there and say, God, mm. you have seen I've tried. Mm. He's not talking. Mm. And now you see, mm. I've tried to look for a solution. He has refused. So God, you come through. So I'll be like, okay. Oh, so what were you saying after the prayer? So that, that prayer will somehow... 
yeah. or somehow melt in your yeah. you heart mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. you can tell she's frustrated she's yeah. in a dilemma yeah. Yeah. she wants to know are we together are mm-hmm. we moving together or are we mm-hmm. are we are we not together i would i would say that when this stage is prolonged and it's like the not as like the enemy will will always know mm-hmm. when the couple is from one stage to another mm-hmm. and that is the stage you realize mm-hmm. eh? you start getting people to flatter with you good oh. you know you, you start yeah. getting some invitations thank you, thank you pastor mm-hmm. you know you yeah. start getting you start thinking about your former <laughs> ex how are they doing you look for them in fb you yes. go to instagram it's not because the, you are so lonely unapigwa to see mabao au uko unapigiwa na rafiki ambao mlipatana 3 years ago yes you know? the devil. and they yes. look very caring very caring very concerned exactly. they are very gentle mm-hmm. they look very kind yes they want to give you time to vent out yes and you find yourself getting into alcoholism because if you get this friend and you are meeting in the bar mm. you will find yourself now drinking if you're getting someone who is smoking you find yourself now doing shisha mm. i mean that's where in dilemma because now yes. you are in isolation yes. and you're not even having sex yes. dilemma even there is no sex exactly. there is no emotion there is no emotion no emotional attaching uh-huh. attachment no physical attachment you are just no, there no i love you nothing no communication is completely cut ah. down there is a total blackout mm-hmm. in that it's marriage it's a total blackout yes so yeah. some mm. will opt to go the way uh barely saying mm. you or you the way you're saying that someone goes to extreme mm-hmm. and gets a bad company mm-hmm. and goes to the witch doctor another mm-hmm. one mm-hmm. will be suicidal mm-hmm. yeah another one will be suicidal mm-hmm. still at the dilemma mm-hmm. they will start thinking no i think i'm the one who is in the wrong ah. let me die and leave this man if he thinks i'm the one who is uh, not making Suicide me not enjoy thoughts. let me kill the children wow. yeah mm-hmm. so one will mm-hmm. kill herself mm-hmm. or himself yes. and the children uh-huh. or, or 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 clear the whole family at the dilemma at the dilemma mm. a family is completely cleared cleared mm. because one went into dep- depression mm. they are trying to pursue the other person seems like it's impossible mm. and so the only way now out wow. of this frustration mm. the enemy tells you kill yourself mm. kill leave him mom maybe mm. Mm. could it be that the enemy's strategy in this dilemma and these stages is to kill either your destinies because you said that when there is drama there is no prosperity mm-hmm. so you will be remaining in that state for a very long time mm-hmm. and also you will have no plans for we, together as a couple yeah. mm-hmm. of course god cannot command his blessings there so it's a season no of unity. yeah there, there's mm-hmm. a season of dryness and then this is a person also con- con- contemplating physical nini uh, yeah. kukufa so it is it is like the enemy is trying to create a, a scenario of death mm-hmm. either physical or and it can start with just an argument mm. that's why people i i really encourage a couple if you realize mm. you are having constant small small arguments you need to look above that argument yeah. mm. above each uh, from the bigger picture you need to just look at it why if it is happening in a certain pattern mm. maybe mm. the devil cannot find you from infidelity you are a child of god or something or drunkenness but he'll find you through anger Mm. or offense yeah. you hold offense mm. you get easily offended so you find that you will always fight mm. or you keep quiet or something i, I think uh, what you are saying mom this mm. is an antidote to so many marriages yes mm. and people should take this thing so seriously mm. because you have seen so many news mm-hmm. in news whereby a couple has killed, the husband has killed sure. children plus mm-hmm. himself and the wife mm-hmm. which means they were just in a stage if only they knew this mm-hmm. information that you're talking about yeah, right here now mm-hmm. they would have sold, they would have sold it out mm-hmm. and also there's a marriage if they watch this video mm-hmm. they're going to be helped yeah. i remember there was a time i was in that stage because it was both a dilemma mm-hmm. and also because of drama i think it was either drama dilemma mm-hmm. and you know there's no blessing and there was this issue of so much brokenness mm-hmm. and 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 luck mm-hmm. in a very serious way mm-hmm. and when when our kids were still very young they were think something like 2 to 3 months mm-hmm. the first the twins mm-hmm. so i just somehow was i was so much frustrated the marriage is not looking like like it's working so i said i have to end my life so i went to a river i was staying in a lorry i said I, i said i want to finish this thing here today mm-hmm. there's no i could see I'm in a very frustrated marriage not actually it was frustrated but I was just feeling that I can't no longer provide for my family mm-hmm. and then uh-huh. I'm not happy mm-hmm. things are not working on soil the way I was thinking mm-hmm. then I'm looking at my wife there she cannot feed well so I went to the river and said I want to finish it here today mm-hmm. so I wrote a very long message for her 
asked Ambia. Which I never received. Yeah, I told her. I, I told her. Uh -huh. So I told. <laughs> imagine. And then I, that, that's the mystery. Uh -huh. I told her I, I've tried my best as the man of the house, but things are not working. Mm -hmm. As you've seen, it's either quarreling, fighting. There's no money. I have to feed you. There's no job. So you tell. Imagine I loved them, but I told as a man, but I could not. And then I sent the message. I made sure it has left my phone. And then I closed my phone. I was now about to jump with the water. Mm. Then someone called me, a friend of mine. We were with him in the university. He's called Kilian. I really respect that guy until now. And yeah, he used to call me Prof. Hey, Prof, how are you? I'm fine, Prof. And yeah, siku mingi bana. Uli pata kazi. Immediately after that. Yes, I'm just now about to jump with the water. And yeah, I can use. Uli pata kazi. And yeah, Prof, siku pata kazi, but we are trying. And so, man, that's don't worry. I'm just pata kazi. Like in the morning, my minister pata kazi. Like in the morning, I'm scared to go to the Prof. Let me send you some breakfast. I was like, I die with the money. I can't. <laughs> Who dies with an Mpesa message? Yeah. I, so said, I, 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 I said, <laughs> let, me, le, let, me, let me see what. He sent me 500 shillings. Wow. So, the only dilemma I was now having is the message I sent my wife. How will I go back home with the shopping and I was supposed to die? So, I went, did some shopping very, very fast, rushed to the house. I said, Where's your phone? She told me, My phone is there. I went and took the phone, checked it, there was no message. I stayed with that, that phone. The I, st I, st I stayed with the phone most the whole day, waiting for that message to come, so that I can delete it before she sees it. That message has never reached her phone. So today, to today, and I went to my phone, checked out box, it was sent and delivered with the, the two ticks. So I think the way you're saying that stage comes with suicidal, suicidal uh, spirit, thoughts. Mm. thoughts, and you want mm. to finish. I think if I end this, mm. I'll finish my life. Yeah. Then I'll not be here speaking about Imagine. this right now. Yeah. Yeah. Let, me, let, me, let me just add, mm -hmm. I would want to say something. I don't know I would say it because of the show, but mm. I really appreciate our journey. Mm. And I always appreciate my husband. Mm. Because when I found my husband, I found him a man who had never seen any love anywhere. Mm. The first mm. hug he got for was from my mom, was it from my mom yeah, from or my father? <laughs> That's when, he, the first time he saw a family. Yeah. He had yeah. always lived with the people mm -hmm. going to this family and this family. Mm. And then, here he's faced with a family. Mm. He has two people who are looking up to him. And no, those people, that's why I'm very, very much big on energies, building yourself and being whole from within. Mm. Because if you are whole from within, you, you have what is called tenacity. Yeah. You can mm. stand pressure. Those mm. days you couldn't. Uh, and yeah. mama would pray. With those little faith I had, God yes. would hear me somehow. Yeah. <laughs> so I appreciate Salono because he overcame the little boy mm. and he became a man. Mm. Mm. That is one thing I'll always thank God for. Salano overcame anger, Salano overcame self doubt. One thing he used to feel that maybe his marriage would end up like. My father's. Oh, yes. Uh -huh. Yes. But and that I was always waiting for that period. Yes. I knew it will come, but I didn't know. Uh, and I told him. Yes, I knew it will end one day, but I didn't know when. Yes. So you're waiting. No, and no, it was so yeah, so that. whenever I saw any any serious, uh, most close to Maria, yeah. I knew maybe this was this like, the it time. is now. It is this now. Time. Mm. But no, do you know what I would tell him and also mm. tell God? Mm. God, uh, my mom is a woman of faith. Mm. I would tell him where I come from, women don't fail. And I will not bring up my generation in a dysfunctional home. Mm. They're going mm. to be whole. And you are a great man. Even sometimes when we disagree, I come, I'm a crazy wife and mm. God understands me. I <laughs> prophesy over him. Hey, you are a king. You are a great man. I want you to be sober. When you, you look be... Uh, and she's yeah. saying that in the midst of serious quarrels. Argument. This it's is like not you. Are you. A king. You are a man of respect. Yes. And you are going very far. But this behavior, it's you not see, you. you are a servant of God. And I refuse. And those words will begin hitting me. So yeah, I Yeah, he cannot f yeah. do anything. Wow. That is me. So the, the how she deals so. with issues twice. Mm. Once, it's like that. Mm. Professor, big things on YouTube are not saying. <laughs> Another thing, she'll come. When things are very, very good, <laughs> the best mood you are there is in each other, and you say, hey, You are a very good man. <laughs> but it a be new kitchen at two nine as a so I'll be like, oh, okay. <laughs> so you have to change because of, but they always say everything is always about how you approach the issue. Yes. The issue can be so big, but then you approach it in a very loving way. Yes. I'll change it because of how she brought it out. I, I, I love your story. Yeah. So real. Yeah. And I think you're helping so many people yes. by that. Eh? Yes. One of the things that happen also eh, when we're in this stage, mm. you're in drama and dilemma. Mm. And now we're talking about dilemma. Mm. Uh, it is when um, when you get an open door to go overseas, it looks like a blessing. A blessing. Mm -hmm. You God know, has come through. Uh, you get it. Yes. Eh? Especially if you're in drama mm -hmm. and dilemma. Yes. 
if you get a transfer from where you are working yes. to go a little bit further, mm. where you have to take a month before you come back home. You're in Nairobi, another one is in Mombasa. <laughs> yes, you know, it looks like it is a blessing. A blessing. Mm. So one is looking for an opportunity mm. to go away. away. Mm -hmm. What you talked about flight. Yes, you are on flight mode. Yes. Running you away know? From the and then also, yes. the, you know, in yeah. this stage, your mm. dilemma, mm. there's a lot of what he said. Yes. What will the community say? Mm. Ah. You see, as Sarano ah. said, remember you still have the dream. Mm. <laughs> and dream yes. is what made you go to drama. Yes. Drama has yes. taken you now to dilemma. dilemma. Uh -huh. So in this stage, you are still wondering, mm. what will people say? Mm. And then we had a big wedding. Mm. The way it looked like this marriage will work. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of peace faking. Mm -hmm. oh. There's a lot of peace faking. Right then, peace faking. No, no, in yeah. this stage, yes. your dilemma, yes. 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 You, no, you are not facing reality, mm. but at the same time, yes. you, are, you are actually peace faking mm -hmm. because there is no peace but you still want to show the people that uh, you had told them how your marriage is good it's gonna still work uh -huh. then after that in uh -huh. still dilemma yes you get into peace breaking mm -hmm. peace breaking it is where now you even become physically you, you begin to physically attack one another there is assault mm -hmm. there is threat na uh kuchukulia -huh. kisu because I, I still feel, wow. do I leave you for another woman? Mm. Do I leave you for another man? Mm. So there's now, now we want to break. We have faked, faked. Now we want to break to it. Break. And that we want to break enough. it. So yeah. Don't buy a mass out. Uh -huh. If by paradventure, if God comes mm. in, that's when you find people taking one another to the courts. Okay. For litigation. litigation, litigation. That happens again there. It happens at ah. that stage of dilemma. Mm -hmm. In that stage, because now you want uh -huh. to step out, and at the same time you want to file the, the papers for divorce, mm -hmm. because you feel you want to go back and maybe live your single life or get another chick and marry or another charity and marry. Mm -hmm. So in this stage, there is uh -huh. a lot of peace breaking. Mm -hmm. If that doesn't work, the last stage of dilemma mm -hmm. is suicide to one person or murder to of the whole, whole family. family. And it is done. Bad. Your family meisha, meishi, dream, drama, dilemma, death. death. Mm. So you start. That's why. That's why I said uh, the person who is in drama is the devil. Because what did he do? He has stolen them, mm -hmm. stolen their joy, stolen yes. their peace, mm. stolen their unity. Then after that, he has destroyed them in drama, wow. destroyed them at the dilemma stage, and then now he has now accomplished his last mission. He has killed. Murder has entered. So you said, my dear, mm -hmm. uh, under this stage, mm -hmm. I heard you like you talked about like four things. Yes. That are you know one should watch. Yes. You should be very careful. Uh -huh. Peace, faking. faking. Okay. Peace, faking. Peace, faking is when okay. we come to your home. Yes. You want to look like you are together. Uh -huh. mm. Yes, darling. Yes, how are you? <laughs> you know. Yes. And you don't know the reason why God has brought this couple. God has brought them so that now you open up your issues. Mm. Because you know his pastor Sue and you yes. know his pastor Monene yes. and you know what we stand for. Exactly. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. Yes. But because you still want to fake yes. that yes. all is well. Yes. That's when you want to look. Yes, darling. Uh -huh. Yes, what? Mm. Yes. Then. The next minute after one week, you hear yeah. Pastor Munene killed the wife. Mm. And you're like, no. We visited them, we visited them one and week ago. There. You see now? Exactly. So you start with peace, peace faking. faking. Mm. Then the second then one. Then now you feel, no, yes. I have faked, I have faked. Now you are at your last. Now you enter into peace breaking. breaking. Mm. You feel, no. Watch out. Let it just appear the you way it is. Calm now you are wow. self, self completely. Wow. Yes. And then I, in then that from, stage of dilemma yes. is where now we have Either litigation. one getting into uh, your, your also litigation, litigation, now number litigation. Three. Yes. If, if by God's mm, chance mm. litigation now gets in, yeah. you go to and you think, you know, let me just divorce this man. Mm. Now, if the worst comes to us and you have seen that even in the news, even yes. in Kenya right now, mm. and even in the world, that's where people, one, one person either commits suicide or you get the point, or commit suicide, or kills others, mm. kills the wife, the husband, yeah, and actually, and actually, uh -huh. committing suicide. Mm. Or there is murder. Murder is, you take a gun, you take a knife, mm. yeah, there is bloodshed. Mm. 
uh, there is people are, are, are in number one they are in denial mm -hmm. because now you are you are arguing with the reality mm -hmm. versus what you expected mm -hmm. the expectations have not been met mm -hmm. in fact in dilemma you feel so frustrated that all the expectations you had in marriage mm -hmm. or for marriage has now been shattered by your partner mm -hmm. or you both have shattered them mm -hmm. so in this stage we have said the the people get into denial some go into flight you know they keep nobody you don't want to stay near the other person uh -huh. one person may get into depression mm. so this depression may may go to suicide alternative and in that stage you're actually peace faking you are peace faking you want to still show people you are together